Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, Turner's Variety Channel. Um, I have a fall Bath & Body Works haul to share with y'all today. It's a fall haul, y'all. Um, I decided to get some fall at Bath & Body Works because actually, funnily enough, of all the Bath & Body Works uh, products I have, I have absolutely no fall body care until now, which I finally got my hands on some of the new fall body care that's out. Uh, fine fragrance mists, fine fragrance mists, Wow, that's a bit of a tongue twister. All the fine fragrance mists are $4.95 today, which today is Friday, August 4th, and I believe it's also going on on the 5th, Saturday, August 5th as well. So, if you haven't had a chance to get your hands on the $4.95 fragrance mists, I highly recommend you do. It's a very great deal, especially for the fancier, like, faceted uh, mists. Anyway, so before we get started, uh, allow me to introduce you to my favorite drink, which is Arizona peach tea. I'm going to take a sip of it. Delicious. Oh, it's so refreshing, you guys. Anyway, um, let's get started with this haul. So first, I want to... Uh-oh, I have lids falling off, you guys. I want to show you the receipt and how much I saved. I actually got two free things because I used my rewards. If you guys have not downloaded the... um, Sorry, there's something on my desk. The uh, Bath and Body Works My Rewards app, you really should because you get uh, points for every dollar you spend. It's like 10 points, and once you reach like a certain amount of points, you get like like a bunch of like goodies and stuff. So like you spend money and you earn points, and then once you get like a certain amount of points, like you can get free things, and that's how I got my free things. So my total was only 24 or excuse me, 26.24, and I saved 101 dollars and 90 cents. So yeah, that's a very great deal for all this product. Anyway, um, I want to show you guys what I got. I got a bunch of, like, uh, good, like, scents that I kind of like. A lot of them I really like. There's a couple I just got to have. But anyway, so let's get started. Um, let's talk about, oh, what should we talk about first? Let's talk about Black Cherry Merlot. Here's what it looks like. This is what it is in the faceted collection. It's very beautiful, Black Cherry Merlot. I apologize for the glare again. I, again, it's nighttime. Like I said in my last video, I really need to film during natural light because I don't know if you can see, but it is currently dark out because it is almost 10.30 at night. And again, my self decides to film at night and I don't know why, but I will start filming during the daytime eventually you guys i just actually i was like really busy today like i went peach picking today and then i like hung out with some people so yeah anyway anyway black cherry merlot we find the i cannot speak the fragrance <laughs> notes <clears throat> are dark cherry black raspberry and merlot now this one i was hesitant to get at first because a lot of people tell me that this one smells like uh cherry cough syrup I don't get that. I get like a cherry, like I live in Michigan, so like we're known for cherries, and it kind of smells like those cherries. Like up, I know like up in Traverse City is like famous for cherries and all that. So it's definitely like a black cherry. It's like a dark, yeah, a black cherry. It's not a maraschino cherry. It's a black cherry. And I don't really get a Merlot smell to it either. Honestly, it's just black cherry. And funnily enough, um, I need to find something to clean the caps with. Because you know me, and I, I hate the... I spray it in the cap, but I like to dry the cap out. Um, funnily enough, this one they actually... Um, I'll take another drink. Sorry. I'm so much better now. Anyway... They actually brought this out previously. This has been out before. This is not new by any means. They actually commonly bring this out during Christmas time. So I actually found it kind of interesting that they put it in the fall line this year. Yeah. It's a good one. If you like cherry, I think you'll really like this. But I really do not get a cough syrup. No, I don't get like a cough syrup smell to this. Not at all. So, um, this one's a good one, Black Cherry Merlot, and this is the only thing I got in it was Fine Fragrance Mist. I got it just to have it, you know. I probably won't, like, be absolutely, like, 
dousing myself in this. But it's a nice one, so, yeah. Alright, let's talk about sweater weather. How cute is this bottle? It has the leaves on it. Mm, I am so glad I have fall body care in my collection now, because I'm like, I'm like, I absolutely had no fall. This one is Sun Crisped Apple, Autumn Leaves, and Orchard Woods. Now this one, um... This one's good. This one's more of a cozy apple scent. I definitely get, like, an apple woodsy, like, um... I almost said flavor. Scent. Ooh, this one smells really good on me. Ooh, man. That actually smells really good on me. This is another one that actually is returning. I actually... Somebody, if you guys know, please let me know down in the comments, has Sweater Weather been out in body care form? Because I know it's, like, commonly out in candle form, but I don't remember it being in body care. If anybody knows, please comment down below and let me know if Sweater Weather has been out before in body care. I may have missed it. I've only been a Bath and Body Works fan for about two or three years now, so... This one's really good. It's like a fall apple with, like... A woodsy, like a woodsy undertone to it. Like when you first spray it, I definitely get apple, and then there's like, like that woods undertone. Yeah. Again, this one is a very good one for fall. Okay. <clears throat> Next. I got this one. Because although I like how it smells, this is another one that I'm not gonna like. I'll explain in a minute. Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. A fall classic. This one is a classic for Bath and Body Works. Pumpkin Pecan Waffles comes out every year. Actually, I believe this is the first time they have brought Pumpkin Pecan Waffles in body care, too. Because usually it's... Oh, no, maybe not. Because I remember... They had Pumpkin Mar Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. And... Last year they had blueberry maple pancakes, which I, for some reason, I liked how it smelled, but it smelled odd on me, so I didn't get it. And then I forget if pumpkin pecan waffles, I think it actually did. So, um, anyway, pumpkin pecan waffles. Yes, I got a body spray that smells like waffles, you guys. Um, this one is maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. Now, I will say... Oh my god, where's the sprayer? Okay. Yeah, this smells straight up like pumpkin waffles. It's delicious. You can smell that syrup. Definitely smell like the cooked waffle with, like, pumpkin spice. And then there's, like, a hint of maple syrup. Yeah. It's really good. Now, <clears throat> the one thing I will say about this is even though... Oh my god. That's delicious, you guys. That's delicious. I want to eat it, almost. Man, that does smell really good. It smells like breakfast in a bottle. Yeah. Anyway, I was saying, the thing is, is, like, this is definitely not, like, a date night, like, going out to a party scent at all. Like, I do not see myself going out to, like, dinner or any, like, fancy event smelling like pumpkin waffles. No, not at all. This would be, like, a definitely, like, oh, I'm a stay-at-home, like, daytime scent. Like, you know, like, this is definitely, like, one I would wear if I'm, like, not going out anywhere. Because, honestly, I don't want to go out smelling like a waffle, and I don't think other people want to me going out smelling like a waffle either. But it is really good. I will say that is a really good uh, scent for fall. It definitely smells... Like I said, like a waffle with, like, syrup on it. So it's really good pumpkin pecan waffles. It's that one. Actually, look how cute these look together, though. And then, the, actually, after the other one, I'll show you. But look how stinking cute these bottles look together. Which brings me to this one, which I'm going to talk about next. This one right here is Champagne... Excuse me, I'm putting them up on my desk, uh, Champagne Apple and Honey. I love this one so much, I got it in the body lotion as well. And the body lotion, oh my goodness, the bottle this year for Champagne Apple and Honey is, like, on point. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. 
Uh, this is a this has been a fall favorite of mine for many years. I've gotten it every year. I've gotten this probably every year for like three years now, like every fall. But like I said, I use it up like during the fall. So like I said, I don't have any other fall body care to use during fall. So that's why I got more. Um, this one is Crisp Apple, Sparkling Champagne, Jasmine Honey, and Autumn Woods. A classic fall fragrance. Mm, it, it, oh my goodness. Oh, champagne, apple, and honey. How I love you. Oh, this one's amazing. I, 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 again, a classic for me. Like, this is one I get every year. And it always comes back. And I love it for good reason. It definitely is like a very tart, uh, crisp apple. With like, an undertone of like, honey to it. And it's like, perfect. It's a perfect combination. I am sorry, there is something in my ear. Oh, it's like a perfect combination of, like, apple and honey. And I don't really get much of the jasmine, which I I was worried when I first, like, found out about this a couple years ago. I was worried I wasn't going to like it because of jasmine, because I'm not really a jasmine fan. But it's pretty good, actually. I it, It's really good, you guys. I definitely recommend I'm going to clean the cap out, which I didn't do for pumpkin pecan waffle, just whatever. That. I'll just do it later. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. This is delicious. Delicious, I tell you. Oh, yeah. It smells like apples, and it smells like picking an apple off of a tree and taking a bite out of it. It's so good. And then in the body lotion, it smells the same in the body lotion. Um, same notes. This is actually made with vitamin, a, vitamin E, shea butter, and coconut oil. Delicious. This is like a classic for me, and I look forward to using champagne and apple and honey again this fall. It's like a staple. Like, it's one that I have to have. But, allow me to introduce you guys to my new favorite fall scent, you guys. I am so happy they brought this in body care for the first time ever in Bath & Body Works history, I believe. Maybe. This is all, before I tell you guys what scent it is, this scent has only come out in candles, soap, and hand sanitizer form, and I have been telling people every year, I wish, I wish they would bring this out in body care. I wish they would bring this out in body care. And they brought it out in body care. Leaves. They have leaves in body care, you guys. They have leaves. Oh my goodness, you guys. Leaves and champagne, apple, and honey is like my two favorite scents from Bath & Body Works. They're like near and dear to me. Um, I have not sprayed this yet in leaves, so this is going to be a first reaction. I it, it, it better smell like what the candle smells like. I would kind of, I did, okay, I lied. I fibbed. I smelled it in the store, but since I was mixing a bunch of things, I didn't get a good true sniff of this. Um, it has the same notes. It is crisp apple, golden nectar, and warm clove spice. You ready, you guys? <clears throat> Excuse me. Yep. Yep. Oh my god, I love it so much. Oh my goodness. This is like the best fall scent ever. It smells like the candle. Oh, uh, it's, okay, so it's like apples and cinnamon. Like, that's it. It's like apples and cinnamon. It's like, oh my goodness, I'm going to spray myself with this right now. I'm smelling like leaves. I don't care. Um, oh my goodness, I'm so happy right now, you guys. This smells exactly like the candle. Oh my goodness. Um, I better tell you more what it smells like, though, before I, oh my god, that smells so good. Okay, it's, it's like a warm apple. With, like, spices. It's, like, warm. It's a warm, inviting fragrance. I I definitely recommend you get leaves and body care because I bet a lot of people are happy that they finally bought this out in body care. And they better bring this back next fall because I I feel like this is, might be one that, like, they might bring this year but not bring next year. So I'm a little scared. Again, this one is amazing. This would be perfect for, like, a cold autumn day. Because it's really warm, like I said, and inviting. Yeah, that's amazing. Oh my goodness, you guys. Leaves. You gotta get leaves, I'm telling you. You need to run now to your nearest Bath and Body Works and grab leaves. I don't care. Go now before they run out. 
It smells the same in the body lotion, too. Um, <clears throat> which, it's actually funny, because they don't have the notes on the body lotion, but they have them on the fragrance mist, though. Like, I don't know if you can read that. But, uh, let's talk about the packaging, too. It's actually really, really stinking pretty, the packaging for leaves this year. Although, I say this year, this is the first year they brought it out in body care. Oh my goodness. I hope they bring leaves back next year, because this is an amazing, amazing scent. It, it, oh my goodness. It actually smells almost, it, this actually, I could see myself wearing this around Halloween. Because, like I said, it's like a warm apple with like cinnamon this would be perfect for like halloween or november definitely kind of reminds me of like halloween bonfires but anyway i need to stop rambling because we got to end this video because we are going on almost 16 minutes of video so i'm going to end it here um i hope you guys enjoyed putting this up here this video so much i hope you guys like uh leave a comment down below give it a thumbs up, and also subscribe if you like this kind of content. If you guys want me to do any further reviews on any of these uh, scents, please let me know in the comments below, and I will try my best to do. Um, yeah. So like I said, leave a comment. I will try to reply to all of you guys. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye, everyone.